How to vacuum seal your very first bag using your new USV20 chamber vacuum sealer. You'll want to make sure that the sealer is plugged in and powered on using the power switch on the back left hand corner of the sealer. For this demonstration, we are going to use an 11 by 10 chamber vacuum pouch that was included in your sample bags. We're also going to use an Avid Armor Avocado Squishy. To start, go ahead and lift your lid. And since the item that we're vacuum sealing is so small, we are going to need to increase our vacuum time. So the default settings are 20 and four, and we're going to go ahead and change this to a vacuum time of 25. We'll leave the seal time setting the same since we're vacuum sealing um, an Avid Armor pouch. So place your item in the bag and then you'll place it in the chamber with the opening of the bag over the seal bar. You're gonna lift open the pouch clamp and place the bottom side of the bag underneath the pouch clamp, leaving the top uh, free. That allows air to freely uh, escape the bag when it's going under vacuum. So once your bag is in the chamber, make sure that it's nice and smooth across the seal bar so you don't get any wrinkles in your seal. And then once your bag is placed, go ahead and close the lid. And all you have to do is tap the auto vacuum seal button for it to begin the auto vacuum seal process. You can press down on the lid to get the vacuum, to help the vacuum engage. You'll notice that the, the vacuum gauge begins to rotate as the chamber goes under vacuum. It's counting down the vacuum time. Once the vacuum time is complete, it goes into seal mode. It's now sealing the bag. And then the air gets put back into the chamber causing the pouch to collapse and uh, become vacuum sealed. So once the cycle is complete, lift your lid, lift your pouch clamp, you can remove your bag, inspect your seal to make sure that it's nice, clean, and consistent all the way across. No, no bubbles, no wrinkles that could lead to bag failure. And then now your very first bag is ready for storage.